All right, this is a video to show how halation works and how color is relative. And what I'm doing is just making two squares on either side, a yellow square and an orange square, and then using Illustrator to do a blend, which creates the three children. And they should be proper steps. And what you see when you get the accurate children is a halation effect. And so you see a little bit of yellow on the right there and a little bit of orange showing up on the left and that's halation uh, this is a gradient and halation sort of looks like a gradient but it's just single swatches up there that are creating that effect do is resize these squares down below to create a background color and now the background is what's going to affect the color as relative effect here and so we'll make this left square background straight yellow and the right square straight orange and then we'll make uh, two small swatches one on the left and we'll make this the child just to the right of yellow and we'll make this other swatch here the child just to the left of orange and what happens is these two swatches sort of look like they're the same color if we move them around you can see that what makes them look like the same color is the background so the background color you can see here, really affects how the swatches themselves show up. There's no uh, sleight of hand happening here, I'm just moving these swatches simply around and you can see that when they're next to each other they're not the same color and once again when they're back on their relative backgrounds they look very similar. And that's how color is relative.